That leads us over from bodybuilding.com. Walking out, fourth place check, 55 grand. Nice payday for somebody coming up. And we will take that fourth place award. The check for $55,000 to our fourth place finisher. Dennis Big Bang Wolf. Well, he said Dennis Wolf put up his eyebrows there. Larry, your, your cheat sheet that you have over there is once again correct. Those are self-made notes, but uh, Dennis Wolf did not look thrilled. I don't know if you caught the expression on his face there when they announced him as fourth, but did not seem entirely pleased. I did. He was third last year, so he drops a spot. But he and Sean Roden definitely have a rivalry going on. Now in, in their last seven contests, Dennis has won four. We're finished ahead of Sean in four. Sean ahead of him in three. So at the Arnold Dennis Wolf did pull ahead. He actually won that competition. Oh, Here sure. we go. Brittany Holm from Ultimate Nutrition will take the third place award. The check for ninety thousand dollars. The Olympia bronze medal to our third place finisher. Lexatron, Sean Roden. As expected, Sean Roden comes in third. And you can see why Dennis Wolf may have been a little bit miffed there. I mean, the, the prize money between fourth and third, it's significant. Going from 55000 whereas Sean Roden's check is going to be $90,000. So almost double that for third to fourth place. It's uh, You see the nice camaraderie between those two. Uh, they, they have a rivalry that's built over the years, like you just mentioned, Larry. But great job by Sean Roden. You talked about how he came into the con competition and continually looked better as we went from pre-judging and even peaking tonight. Really nicely done by Sean. And I think one of the only competitors that when you compare at the upper group, when you compare last year to this year, you saw some significant improvement. Mm -hmm. Final comparison here for the judges. Both presenters will be on stage. Runner up will receive a check for $130,000. The Olympia Silver Medal. The next name you hear will be your 2014 Mr. Olympia. Presenting the first place award that is being held by Jim Mannion and it is a special edition 18 karat gold sandal statue. The Ben Weider Standard of Excellence Award will be presented by Mr. Rafael Santoja. They will take those awards, a check for $275,000. They will take all that in the title of 2014 Mr. Olympia. And we'll find out who that winner is right after these messages. <laughs> Hang on a second. Robin says there are no messages. Well, in that case, you're Mr. Olympia. Is four-time Mr. Olympia Phil! Congrats, bro. 
<laughs> nice sportsmanship there, Kai Green. Looks disappointed, but shakes the hand to Phil Heath. Kai Green once again getting runner up, and Phil Heath. What a performance by him. Time and time again, we are impressed by the way that he looks, the type of shape that he shows up in, and once again did it this year, despite having a lot of things going on in his life, he uh, he did it. Another Mr. Olympia, $275,000 going into his pocket tonight. Just a great performance by him. We'll be talking to him on our post show along with all of the other winners here tonight. And Phil mentioned at the press conference that he dedicated this Mr. Olympia to his father, who died earlier this year. So I'm sure a very emotional win for, for Phil Heath as he gets his fourth Sandow in a row. Our post show is starting immediately. Bob is going to talk to Phil on stage briefly, and then he's going to join us backstage as we round things out for bodybuilding.com. Certainly appreciate you watching the broadcast. We've got much more to come, so hang in there. Hang on, Kai. Okay? All right, let's have our top five in place, please. Gentlemen, on the center line, please. Photographers got to do their job. Gentlemen, your favorite pose, please. But a big hand, folks, our top five Olympians. Thank you, gentlemen. Bill Heath, now four-time Mr. Olympia. Folks, history continues to be made here on the Olympia stage. The last time somebody won four in a row was the great Ronnie Coleman. Bill now putting himself in elite category. Bill, you are the 2014 Mr. Olympia. Four sandals on your mantle. This one the most special, I'm guessing a solid gold sandal. Wow. Um, well, uh, first of all, I just wanted to say thank you all for coming out. What an amazing event. You know, please give yourselves a round of applause because, I mean, you guys came from all far and wide, seriously, from all over the world to celebrate the Joe Wieters, Mr. Olympia, in the 50th edition. Um, there's so many people I'd like to thank. I mean, first of all, I'd like to definitely thank, you know, Joe Weeder and Ben Weeder. I mean, you know, I was able to meet both of them, you know, when I was an amateur. And I remember going over to the Weeder headquarters and being able to see Joe personally. And I remember him saying, hey, Phil, you know, flex the bicep. And I remember flexing the bicep and uh, he says, oh, this guy's got the goods. And he was telling that to Peter McGuff. And Peter says, hey, Joe, we already signed this kid. He's going to be good. So, you know, it was awesome, you know, to be able to, you know, visit with him and, and visit with, you know, a lot of the guys, you know, that helped, you know, spark the interest of bodybuilding. You know, when I got into this on October 8th, 2002, 
I had no idea that I'd be on this very stage before you. But let me tell you, you know, with a lot of hard work and dedication and a lot of prayers, you know, I am here as four-time Mission Olympia and my God, like, thank you, Jesus. Like, this is amazing. This is an amazing achievement for me. And, um, you know, I obviously have a lot of people to thank. You know, I have my, my family over here. You know, you guys, you guys are awesome. You know, I have my, I got my gifted nutrition guys over here. You know, I've got, you know, all my War for Four fans over here, you know, and, and quite honestly, you know, you know, when we're doing these shows and, and we're, we're trying to become the best, you know, it's people like you who email us, who call us, who give us levels of encouragement. People like you, like, I, I would never really get to meet, you know, like in my gym and in Armada, Colorado. But you guys made the commitment to come down here, and not just to support me, but to support all these amazing athletes, both men and women, in their journey to become the best, the best in the world. So I salute each and every one of you guys. I really appreciate each and every one of you guys for that. Because without you guys, there would be no show. Um, you know, obviously there's a lot of emotions going on, and I'm very, very excited. Normally I'd be up here bawling my eyes out. Um, 